Did the last Catholic priest to sneak into Japan not face the choice of execution or apostasy? Giovanni Sadati was born in Sicily in 1668. As a priest, he learned of the challenges in Japan, and he gained permission from Pope Clement XI to try and enter the country. He sailed to Manila and, in 1708, finally found a ship willing to take him to Japan. He disembarked at Yakushima, the island shown at the bottom center of the screen. Yakushima is close to Tanegashima, the first place in Japan ever reached by Europeans. He disguised himself as a samurai. However, he was soon captured. Owing to his European facial features, and the fact that he was, well, too tall to blend into the populace. Sadati was sent to Edo, the old name for Tokyo, in 1709, and was interrogated by Arai Hakuseki, a scholar and politician famous in Japanese history for having written hundreds of works. Arai, who was himself considered a genius, was so taken with Sadati's level of education that he recommended deportation, eschewing the requirement of Christians being tortured until they died or apostatized. If Sadati could not be deported, then he recommended imprisonment with execution only as a last resort. The government chose imprisonment, sending Sadati to the Christian mansion a place in Tokyo built for holding missionaries that had never actually been used. He was placed under house arrest and his caregivers were two elderly former Christians. When he tried to convince his caregivers to readopt Christianity, he and possibly all three of them were put into a small cell in the basement. He died in either late 1714 or early 1715. His remains were found in 2014. As I mentioned, Arai penned hundreds of works. This included a record of his conversations with Sadati. Arai came to believe that Christians were not the vanguard of some European military force to come later. But he did believe that Christianity created rebels wherever it went. A monument to Sadati can be found at Yakushima. If you like my Japanese history snippets, please follow, subscribe, like and share my videos. Also, please check out my books. Thank you very much.